This bridge, I believe, is a significant day for the Bungala people and other peoples uh, from the Port Augusta region. I'd like to thank the dignitaries for coming here, but I'd also like to thank you, the, the public, for being here. It's great to see that uh, we have a community that is uh, diverse and willing to participate in things that are of importance to Port Augusta. I'm proud that I grew up in Port Augusta, born and bred, and now I've been part of a legacy to deliver a new bridge. I just think this is going to open up the whole opportunity for the northern part of South Australia, the Air Peninsula and other locations, not only for the uh, ever emerging uh, renewable energy projects that are happening in the north and this area here, but also in the resource opportunities, but it's the in, uh, important issue of tourism. Ah, uh, that bridge is good. We've been able to um, provide fantastic and really long-term opportunities for, for local companies. Uh, so proud, proud to be associated with that. You know, we are the crossroads of Australia and it's just nice to, you know, be able to be here for the opening of, like, something that is so, I don't know, big. We started this project, my daughter had just been born and now two and a half years later I got to walk across the bridge holding her hand this morning. So it's, it's been a really, really special day for me. I want to make a, a, pay a special tribute to not only the people of Port Augusta for their patience, their dedication and commitment to this bridge. Nearly 18,000 vehicles cross this bridge every day, about 6% heavy vehicles. So to actually have a duplicated bridge, it'll actually improve resilience, make a greater network for our national transport links. You know, the team has spent nearly two and a half years working from planning through to development, through approvals, to through the design phase to really get this uh, bridge completed. Outstanding team effort, the, the resilience everyone's shown from you know, project staff, subcontractors, suppliers, even the community have been so um, receptive and welcoming us in this period. I just want to also reiterate that everyone said, I can't thank the Port Augusta community enough for their patience while we've delivered this work. Um, it's been exceptional. Again, I want to acknowledge the men and women that have worked on this project as well. I want to pay tribute to my CEO of the department, uh, which is sharing with uh, Minister Coots and Tonus, who can't be here today, uh, John Whelan. John is absolutely fantastic. He's an easy person to work with, and I only have to make a phone call to John and the issues are rectified. Great thing to be a part of, and I'm sure we'll all look back on this for you know, the rest of our careers. It's something we'll really cherish and, and really hold on to.